Hi friends, this is Leo421 here to help you solve the puzzle of level 10 in Candy Crush Jelly. It's another crack the frosting to find the Puffler's level, and I hope it's the last one. I seem to be getting a lot of those. Alright, so it looks like we've got to collect four Pufflers. We've got 25 moves to do it. Uh, but I do see the problem here. I'm not sure what this white stuff is. It might be like a double thick stuff. I don't know how this game operates yet. Ooh, look at this striped wrapped combo right at the beginning. I like that. I want to go for it. I want to go for the middle bits. I think those are the better places to go when we match. Ooh, now I've got a wrapped candy that I'm trying to set up. I see a puffler here. Ooh, fish wrapped could be particularly helpful. Let's go for it. There we go. It's so nice. It just blows up a bunch of things. And I see where this one little guy is, but it's trapped in a licorice lock. This guy's done. We're halfway there now. I just have to get rid of this licorice lock. There we go. Okay, this guy's done. Now, where's my other guy? I'm trying to find if I if it's somewhere. I think he's right here. I can't quite tell. Yep, he is. So I've got one spec to go here. And I've got this to help. Ooh, I can make a fish. Ah, let's see if I can match. There we go. No, not yet. I have to set this off somehow. There we go. We got that open. There we go. Got it. Okay, so there we go. We caught the pufflers. And it was my first playthrough for recording purposes. But it required a little bit of luck in that setup in the beginning. And if you don't have a good setup, you can exit and enter without losing any lives or boosters. It does work on this game. However, in the real Candy Crush and Soda, it does not, unfortunately. But there we go. That's how I beat this level. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.